Manchester United have intensified their pursuit of Mason Mount in recent weeks and look set to address one of Gary Neville's major transfer concerns. Mount's 18-year spell at Chelsea looks set to end this summer, with the midfielder entering the final 12 months of his contract and ongoing talks showing little sign of progress. Several Premier League sides have been keeping tabs on the situation, with United joined by Manchester City and Liverpool. But the Reds cemented their place as favourites to land the 24-year-old with two formal bids, the most recent of which was worth up to £50 million. Despite Chelsea's rejection of that bid, Mount remains the club most immediate issue and there is still belief a deal can materialise. A swift conclusion would be evidence of lessons learned from previous years, with the club so often dithering over big-name targets and missing out. Most recently, the pursuit of Frenkie de Jong stretched through the entirety of last summer before ultimately fizzling out. I think every Manchester United fan is a little bit tired of us, Neville told the overlap last summer. I said this about Sancho and it's the same now with de Jong. It gets to the point where a signing that should give excitement for the club becomes dragged on for too long, it drags on that long that, in the end, you actually lose excitement for the signing. It almost becomes a little bit of an embarrassment, and it's still happening. So, I am really concerned about the fact that they can't get signings over the line still. There is still a long way to go regarding Mount's potential transfer, with Chelsea remaining steadfast in their valuation believed to be around £70 million. Sources have told the Manchester Evening News that their offer is generous and that there is a reluctance to overpay for a player entering the final year of his contract. But there is also an element of simplicity in that the fee is the only stumbling block left. Mount agreed personal terms at the end of May, with his representatives having already held all the necessary discussions with the club in anticipation of the move. Ticking off the most pressing concern quickly will allow Eric Ten Hag to focus his resources elsewhere, with a world-class no. 9 Next on the summer shopping list. A first-choice goalkeeper is also needed with David De Gea set to leave upon the end of his contract, while reinforcements across the board are being discussed. It will also go some way to righting the wrongs of summer's past in which United have been unable to push key moves over the line.